Welcome, Bishop Moore Catholic, to our Lenten video series. Last week, Ashley and I were speaking about Lent as a spiritual battle and how we can't forget that we have three enemies to our soul, the devil, the flesh, and the world. But praise be to God, in this beautiful season of Lent, we are given really like the armor to fight against those enemies in prayer, fasting, and almsgiving. And so today we're going to be talking a little bit more about almsgiving. What does it mean? What does the church teach? What are ways that we can strengthen that in ourselves to really fight against our enemy, the world. So the thing that you know about almsgiving, it can just become about money and just simply become about, I'm gonna give what I have in this way to those who need. But when you look at the tradition of the church, it wasn't just about money. It was really about a giving of yourself for something greater. So think of what is the spirit of the world. The spirit of the world kind of looks at simply what's temporal, simply what's here in front of us and says, let's just achieve that. Let's just go after that. And remember, like, the enemy of our world, the world, you know, if we're talking about the three enemies of the soul, the world says this is it. You know, like, get everything you can, grasp, grasp, grasp. Mm -hmm. But the spirit of the gospel tells us, no, that, like, we're not long here. We are a pilgrim church traveling through here. Our homeland is eternity, which means the passing things of the world in themselves, yeah, they're not bad in themselves, mm -hmm. exactly. But if our hearts are there, our treasure is not in heaven. The Christian attitude is, says our treasure is in heaven and all the material realities of this world are given to me. They're entrusted to me to take care of, of course, but I'm a steward to them. They do not belong to me. My possessions don't possess me. And so if we find in ourselves, like, and everyone knows this in your own heart, things maybe you're grasping for in your life, that, you know, it's, it's a, a, a disposition of receiving, you're, you're grasping these, these things or these ideas or even not just material things, this is like gifts and talents. I mean, think time, talent, treasure are like the three things we think of with almsgiving. If you look in your own heart and you see areas where you are grasping, that is precisely the area that you need to strengthen because that is the weak part in your, mm -hmm. your spiritual battle, you can say. So it might not be just giving money. It could be a giving of your time or your talent. I mean, there's so many other ways that you can do almsgiving that maybe a better way to look at it is with the, the virtue of generosity. So that's our, our encouragement for these last part of Lent is to maybe take some time and ask yourself, what is keeping me from truly opening my heart to receive what the Lord has in store for me?